everybody, welcome back to EA Central Pleasure, and in this video we'll be taking a look at a couple small pieces regarding Mass Effect Andromeda. Now remember, the game isn't coming out until holiday of next year, 2016, so it's no surprise that the news we're getting involving the game is kind of small, bits and pieces, and oftentimes more speculative based on these little teases from the developers. But anyways, I find this stuff pretty interesting, I know there's a lot of you Mass Effect fans out there who definitely care to know even the smallest tidbits about the game, so without further ado, let's get into it. So getting started, both of the topics I'll be talking about today are actually coming from the same Mass Effect developer that supplied the info for my previous Mass Effect Andromeda video. Chris Wynn of Bioware is Mass Effect's Senior Development Director and loves talking about his job in Mass Effect on his Twitter account. Take a look at this. We almost used the same name, that would have been awkward. And then he provides a link to an article that discusses the name of the next Star Trek movie, Star Trek Beyond. So believe it or not, Mass Effect Beyond was one of the front-running options for the fourth Mass Effect's title, which, needless to say, wouldn't have gone over too well with many fans, I think, just because it's kinda cliche and I don't know, sounds kinda lame to me, to be honest. After the video, be sure to leave a comment and let me know what you think of Beyond as a subtitle compared to the actual one. I think I know what the majority of you will say, but who knows, maybe there's some of you out there who wouldn't have minded it being called Beyond, and I wanna hear from you. Anyways, moving on to the second piece of this video, as many of you know, Mass Effect 3's ending was disliked by the majority of players, and to put it simply, it kind of forced you just to drop yourself off in not a very happy ending place. So when Wynn was questioned about if the next Mass Effect will have a happier and better ending, he replied in a very optimistic way that points to Bioware certainly aiming to make it that way, saying we will do what we can. So hopefully Bioware has learned their lesson and now knows what fans expect, and will make sure the next Mass Effect's ending is more liked. So that's gonna do it for this video guys, remember to leave a comment down below on what you think of the subtitles and also what you thought of Mass Effect 3's ending and what your hopes are for Andromeda's ending. Of course, Mass Effect 3's ending was the conclusion of the original trilogy, whereas Andromeda's ending will be an ending that could more likely be a cliffhanger, as the game marks kind of the start of a whole new era for the Mass Effect series. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching this quick update video, I hope you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like on this if you did, and I remind you to subscribe for coverage on Mass Effect Andromeda and an array of other highly anticipated EA titles. Once again, this has been Plav, and I'll see you guys later.